hello guys myself manash kundu uh, hope you all know me and i am currently pursuing uh, msc plus phd uh, in iisc bangalore and today is a special day for me because um, today my hostel is uh, i am shifted in my new hostel and that's why um, quite excited hai na to aaj ka jo topic hai to bahut sara request aa raha tha ki what's about my iisc interview experience to aaj ka ye video iisc interview ka experience ke bare mein hoga to iisc interview to offline mein tha to they just give me multiple choice to uh, as soon as i just <coughs> entered the interview room uh, and i just introduced myself to my panel member and uh, they just uh, give me choices that from which subject that means from which area uh, we can ask you then i um, um, tried to tell them tell them that yes sir i am interested in the topic but before that as uh, they know that i am from bsc agriculture background they uh, just asking me that uh, yeah you are from bsc agriculture background so uh, can we ask you uh, anything from plant uh, then i said yes sir okay <coughs> then they just smile and uh, told me that no 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 you just uh, you said uh, from which area uh, we can ask okay then i told them sir i am comfortable uh, in biochemistry and uh, molecular biology and biotechnology and cell biology also mm, but they are repeatedly saying that yeah it is good but uh, which course you were reading in bsc agriculture uh, we want to ask from that particular course that means uh, suppose i am reading uh, plant physiology that means they are uh, they want uh, me to ask uh, from this particular course is na so then uh, they choose and i also agreed with them that uh, yes biotechnology and biochemistry and physiology plant physiology okay then uh, my interview start and uh, on of the professor uh, was asking uh, me uh, that uh, various topics uh, basic concept about biochemistry that means if you are uh, aspirant of iisc aspirant interview then don't worry about the um, depth concept just uh, be ready for your basic concept that means uh, they are asking uh, for my biochemistry section they ask me that uh, why aspartic acid and glutamic acid are acidic okay uh, then what is banana bond and do you know banana bond okay um, and another question was there uh, how we can identify protein dna interaction na protein protein interaction okay what is salting in what is salting out what happen uh, if we add some ethanol to particular protein okay uh, how you can observe this okay then uh, um, um, uh, they just shifted from biochemistry section um, to the plant biotechnology okay they just ask me that uh, what is uh, cry protein and uh, what is the bt that means uh, what is bacillus thuringiensis and what is the transgenic technology okay then uh, what is the advantage and disadvantage of uh, micro uh, um, or micro injection electroporation for this technique that means in the practical view that uh, we can uh, do electroporation in case of plant cell or not okay so uh, what uh, kind of technique is bacterial cell susceptible that's kind of thing then uh, they just asked me that yes we know that uh, cry protein is degraded inside uh, the insect that means uh, the bt technology is that when the insect feed the plant uh, then the insect is destroyed okay so why the uh, not the plant okay that type of question and uh, then one question is about crispr cas technology okay 
so they just asked me the basic things of um, crispr cas technology yes um, they asked me that do you know uh, have you heard crispr cas then i said yes sir so no, i told them that yes sir i have heard this but uh, i on know only the basic things uh, except this i have no idea uh, then they, they just told me yes we always want to know the basic things just tell me the basic okay then i told them and uh, actually uh, in the time they are um, quite impressed and they just uh, in their curiosity or for something just ask me yeah manas uh, do you know the history of crispr cas and uh, actually has it was written by me so uh, i said yes sir then i told them yeah then they shipped uh, this from uh, biotech to the mathematics okay uh, no then biotech at first biochemistry then biotech then chemistry they just uh, ask me the structure of nhcl nh4cl what is coordination number okay um, what is buffer okay so um, what is acidic buffer what is, what is basic buffer what is the difference between nh4cl and nhcl salt okay uh, they just asked me that nhcl is also a salt nhcl is salt and nh4 is a salt and what is the difference between nh4cl uh, and nhcl okay um, and the remaining is uh, that how you uh, prefer um, the suppose one molar uh, concentration uh, solution from suppose uh, 10m that kind of thing that means concentration changing okay after that the um, physics person come in they just, uh, just asked me about the uh, electromagnetic uh, you know, wave about what is electromagnetic wave how it behave what is the use of electromagnetic wave in um, biological field okay then just shifted me in, in mathematics and um, it is really fun to me uh, in the mathematics section <laughs> because uh, okay i will uh, tell you the, the reason later okay so in mathematics section what kya hua ki they just uh, gave me two equations and uh, told me to draw the uh, curve and identify the slope okay then yes i was uh, mm, eligible to solve the problem yeah okay i also draw the curve uh, calculate the slope and uh, but uh, one thing i mm, have not uh, noticed that uh, my uh, curve actually is there is a visually problem that means suppose um, you are taking a point that means 1 comma 10 that means uh, in the x axis 10 and y axis uh, 0.50 and uh, 0.5 okay uh, but what i did i just uh, uh, did not measure the length and just uh, draw it randomly okay so at the um, end of my in, uh, interview uh, the professor who is asking the question uh, said me manas is it visually you are perfectly right and your calculation is perfectly right but is it visually right um, and as i was uh, quite uh, that means uh, cas in the time you know so hoga to hoga aur nahi hua to aur bhi acha hai ha so that's why uh, i said no sir uh i think there is no visually problem okay then my uh, co coordinator our interview coordinator um uh, said that no no manas you are uh, right actually i think he is joking uh, but uh, the professor who is asking the question said no 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 i am not joking there is really a visually problem then i got confused yeah so what is the visually problem okay then i just noticed uh, that in the whiteboard what is the problem but i did not find anything and then just he smiled and said yeah you have not measured x axis and y axis mm, it is not a mistake but it is a visual mistake hai na can you understand my point yeah then i said yes sir yes sir then i just um, make it correct mm, and does uh, the interview uh, going to end but it's not end why uh, because uh, at the end he again asked uh, manas uh, can you uh, tell me uh, from the origin to the x axis distance and the, from the origin to y axis uh, what is this called terminology and at the meantime i forgot the english terminology okay and i smartly really i um, um, really 
it's uh, difficult to not to smile because uh, in the time i forgot the things and i told them that uh, yes sir i uh, can recall it in my own mother tongue uh, but i can recall it in english terminology ha na to then uh, one of uh, the professors uh, said me that uh, asked me that what is your mother tongue then i said uh, sir bengali okay then uh, okay just uh, uh, reply in bengali okay then i said sir it is called um, bhuj and it is called koti uh, i think it's a bengali terminology bhuj and koti okay so i just uh, answered it in my mother tongue and the whole panel smiled with uh, and my interview uh, ended with a beautiful smile you know uh, i did not hope so that yeah i'll be selected or not but uh, i really uh, enjoy the interview okay so my tips uh, for all of you guys that uh, don't be nervous during uh, an online as well as offline interview because uh, in online interview it's quite uh, easy because you just uh, uh, you can see only two to three people and two to three people just uh, notice you nah. uh, but not directly it's by online mode but offline mode that means you are lot of people in my panel there were approximately 10 to 12 uh, professors uh, they are so it's quite uh, difficult to uh, keep you calm and cool so just keep you calm and cool and don't think that ya agar nahi hua to kya hoga ya se nahi milega to kya hoga don't think like that ho to acha aur nahi hoga to kuch na kuch institution mein to admission ho hi jayenge na to be confident and free and i think you can also conquer isc hai na so best of luck to all the incoming students